Good day, everybody. This is Dark Comet. Welcome to my channel. I hope you're having a great day so far. Today, we're going to go deeper and darker into your deepest nightmares and your childhood fears as we explore the little nightmare game. This will be the final DLC. Uh, this is called The Residence. It, we may have to break it apart into two pieces here, depending on how much time it takes to explore and do this uh, level here. The last episode, we saw our little runaway kid. Uh, he doesn't have a name for some reason, don't know why. But he uh, was working with the gnomes and finally got up through the furnace there. Um, he went up on the coal conveyor belt and he ended up in their big hideaway. He said goodbye to the gnomes and then climbed through a shaft, which he eventually ended up on an elevator. As we're going up the elevator, we saw that he was on top and inside was the very frightening Lady Keisha. So, looks like we're going to be trying to get into her house here and maybe defeat her as well. Although, I don't see how because we are paralleling the journey of Six, who we know destroys the Geisha at the end. So. Interesting to see how this one plays out here. Um, you can see that I have none of the collectibles yet. Again, if I don't know what the hidden one is there and I can't find any of the flotsams that uh, are remaining, I'll go back and try to get those at the end there, guys. So let's go ahead and start this adventure here and see where the little runaway kid's journey takes him. Okay, we wake up on the top of the elevator here very dark level again guys so hopefully you can be able to see it when we record it um, there's a shaft up there on the right so it looks like maybe we can climb up here and maybe jump back onto that middle thing there I can't quite see it but it looks like there's a hook all right let's swing across here into that opening here Okay, we barely got on there, guys. Um, so there's a little gnome up there on the little pipe there. See him? Okay, that's... Uh, oh, there goes some more gnomes there. Where'd you guys go? Are you help are we also working with gnomes in this one? I don't know. Well, let's see here. Oh, okay. We The music has changed. We are inside the lady's residence. Um... bottom floor looks like looks why are all these books piled up on the ground here okay we're obviously seeing this from a whole different perspective than we did with six um, let's go ahead and go to the next room here be careful we know the lady could be anywhere again we have pictures on the wall of different ladies we had the geisha up here I don't know why like again you can't hold this um, flashlight still for even a second here there we go. There is an Asian looking lady and then the uh, geisha mask. Uh, kind of scary as well. Very ominous. Got a hallway here. I hear music again. That's not good. That's the last time we heard music that's where the lady was looking in the mirrors. Um, looks like we're just barely ahead of six in this story here. Again, we have a lot of bookcases and lots of books on the ground. Let's look in here. Be careful, the music's getting stronger. That's the right there. There's a chair here to climb. I don't know. Again, pitch blackness. I mean, I don't know how they could have thought that was good. Can we climb up these bookcases here? Oh, okay. We turned on a light. Oh, and there's a, there's a flotsam up there, guys. So this will be our first flotsam of the five. Let's go ahead and open that up. Again, another secret message in a bottle. Wish they'd let us read what those are, who they're from. Mystery. Okay, let's go ahead and go down this way. We decided to break the bottle on the way down for some reason. Okay, so, again, pictures of the lady on the wall. I'm better creep here. 
Oh my goodness, guys. There she is. Heart is pounding. She's looking at a bunch of dolls longingly this time. The Still in front of a broken mirror, but we better be very quiet as we walk by here. Um, looking at dolls. Okay. Man, my uh, character's heart is just racing and pounding on my keyboard here and in the in the audio. Okay. Don't know if she can. There she is back there, guys. Oh, the music just really changed here, guys. This is not good. Okay. Let's do a little bit of exploring down here. Oh, there goes a gnome. Let's chase him here. Alright, we're in a room with uh, statues. There's little holes in the floor here in some cases. Don't know what they are. And then we have a closed door. Okay, so we have a broken statue and two other statues in here. Um, let's figure out what that is here. Okay, we got a little eye globe over here. Not much back here. I guess we had to go upstairs, I guess. Again, we're going to take our time exploring. There is a nice picture of the lady. And we have an upstairs here. Okay, we have a ladder there. And then bookshelves and then a whole bunch of levers and stuff up there let's go ahead and explore this area back over here another set of bookcase uh, this whole place is full of bookcases and books on the floor okay here's another ladder we have some thing to walk on up there we are blocked up there so okay oh there's wheels okay wheels are on the ladder so it looks like we might be able to move that Let's go look in here first before we do anything. A bunch of books on the ground again and bookshelves. Don't see really anything remarkable here. Okay. Let's go ahead and see if there's anything up here. Let's move this. Where do we got to move it to? Maybe to the left. Okay, little runaway boy. Let's climb up here. Don't hear the music anymore. The lady could be anywhere. I hope she doesn't come up behind me. <laughs> okay. Nothing up here except a book. Why would they put a book up here? Oh, we can pick him up. Okay. Can we jump down? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, I guess we can. Um, why are all these books on the ground? Why is they give us a book? We can pick it up. We can come over. Oh, okay. I heard a click. I heard a click. other gaps there is a gap right here in front of us right here looks like I don't know what book they're talking about maybe this one there's a triangle on this book here okay heard the sound again see oh okay I see look there's the it made a little diamond uh, square shape on this one we we oh and this one made the uh, bindings match on that one okay so if there's another Okay, if there's another gap here, maybe uh, we can see circles. Okay, oh, this one has a circle on it. Let's try that. Wow, this puzzle was interesting. Oh! What about the other two books? Okay, maybe they're just distractions? Yes, yeah, see the circles completed on that one. The diagram is completed on this one and the... Okay. Interesting. I, that makes a little sense, I guess. I don't know. What the heck, guys? 
Okay, we're pushing, having trouble pushing this open here. Very creaky. Okay, we have a statue of the lady here. I don't see anything else that is in here. What can we do with this statue? We can carry it. Um, is this a statue or a piece of wood? Huh. I can't quite tell. Put it on the ground here. Okay, this one looks like a piece of wood. Interesting. Okay. <clears throat> so, a wooden statue of the lady. Um, so I can find these later. I, I guess we have to find statues of the lady. This one could be a distraction, or I'm gonna put it right here. Um, let's go over here now. Okay, we have another statue right here. Big eye. I gotta be careful about that. What if it opens up and incinerates us here? It is kind of dripping with that black goo. Look at that. Okay, let's see what happens here. Oh my. Oh, the ceiling's coming down. Oh, the eye close. Okay. Alright. Oh, hey, you know what? Let's go ahead and grab this wooden one here and replace it. Kind of like the Indiana Jones type. I can't see a thing in this game. Okay. I have no idea where I am. Okay, there I am. Um, let's grab, if this truly is a wooden one here. Oh, what's that? Big old clock sounds when I grab that wooden statue. Okay. Okay, so let's replace it like the Indiana Jones thing, like the bags of sand here. Um. See what happens here. All right, so that's oh wow, we got lucky. Okay, the first statue we got was a fake statue, a wooden statue, and it helped us get this statue right here. I don't know where to take. Oh, maybe I'll just maybe the holes in the floor in the statue room is where we have to take this. So let's. I don't know where the lady is. I thought she'd be harassing us by now. Okay. I think the room is over here. The first room we walked in here to here. Okay, nothing happened. Nothing happened. Was there a third one we saw? Okay. All right. So, puzzle is we have two more statues to find, and that one right there. Um, help to raise that podium there. Okay, so we were able to open one pedestal up here. Oh, this is the book room. Let's make sure we didn't have any other books we gotta grab in here or something. Alright, okay. So, let's go ahead and we did that other floor. Um, let's see if we can make it our, our way upstairs here. Don't know why the lady hasn't Man, this is so hard to see. This is so dark in here, guys. I had the, I had the brightness turned all the way up. Hope it doesn't look too uh, faded on your screens. Looks like we have to pull this one to the right here. So far, we've only found one of the bottles. The flotsam bottles. Okay, we have a locked door here, so that means we need to find a key. Alright. We have some kind of contraption here. It looks like some kind of sundial. And there's light up there, so maybe there's a refraction. And we have a lever here. Let's see what this lever does. Okay. 
The lever pulled down means that there's light. Let's see what this button does here. Okay, that helps us move the position of the lights. Uh, let's see what this does. Um, okay. Okay, the puzzle is to figure this contraption out here, I guess. Let's see what happens when we pull this lever again. Oh! Okay, there's a sound there. Okay, so we had two eyes with lights on them. I don't know what happens if you push this button again. Okay, let's push this lever forward here. Push the button. We'll just keep kind of trying different combinations until we get all three. Until we get all three uh, lights on the different eyes. Okay, that one's pointing up now. Whoops. Okay, that's not right. Okay. This might take a while. <laughs> May have to edit this part out if we were if we're short on time here. Okay, we had two on the Back to this position here. Almost, almost on it there. Oh boy, okay. We'll just keep pushing the buttons here until we get the combinations right to. Uh, okay. okay. Oh, that looked like it was the right way. If we were to get the other ones pointed at a certain angle here, and then push this over. Um, I heard one of them go. Okay, now we have those left two here. So let's see what happens if we... We obviously have to change this last light here. We got two on the eyes. Oh, there's the third one, guys. There's the third one. Okay, didn't see anything happen, though. Oh, all right. Oh, okay. We had to walk towards this door here that I didn't see originally. And there's something over here. Okay, we have an elevator. That's kind of cool. I'd want one of those in my house. Except for I'd actually put some lights in my house. This is a very dark game, guys. Let's go ahead and approach this with caution here. I have no idea what's in here. Oh boy. Are you kidding me? This whole place is full of statues. Alright. Um, oh my goodness. It looks like exactly like the lady there. Oh, half these look like the lady. Oh goodness. Okay, there we go. Obviously statues. More statues, tons of statues. Um, bunch of pic creepy pictures on the wall here. There's the uh, granny from the uh, depths. Um, some very weird looking characters here. Let's see if we can hold our uh, fat guy there. Weird face, long nose dude. Um, double, triple chin person. Really weird, like pear-shaped head. Okay. 
little... I feel like if you crouch down we can hold the... Uh... Oh my goodness. This flashlight is so hard to control, guys. Sorry about that. Man, look at that crinkly face lady right there. Alright. Okay, headless statues in here. Something has to do with the statue. Okay, there's buttons on the wall. Okay, we saw... We saw... That creepy... Um, Long-faced nose guy here. There we saw him. Um... Okay, what is this puzzle here? Oh my goodness. There is... The wrinkly face lady we saw in there. Okay, got that. Little creepy baby boy. All of them turned off. Okay, so there's got to be a combo here. Um, I'm going to make the assumption that the the pictures have to be the ones that are, that are on the wall inside there. Um, we saw this pear shaped person. Creepy baby child. Don't remember her, but I do remember the wrinkly face lady. A spike here, boy. We did see the fat guy here. Oh! What? The. I heard a click somewhere. Okay, that was it, guys. What the? All right, this is crazy. Okay, so well, the pictures in here, you have to make sure that you only touch the buttons of the pictures of the people who are in the other room. If you don't, the lights turn off. Okay, that only took a little bit of logic to... Oh, more statues. Okay, be careful here. There's an eye thing again. Again, whenever I see that eye thing, I think that they're gonna be, I'm going to be just obliterated here. I'm going to be caught on fire and turned to ashes myself. Here's obviously the other statue. Oh my gosh. Oh! Okay. How am I going to get out of this? Okay. Alright, it's moving. I did get a little bit of smoke coming off me there, though. Usually, the last time if... Oh my goodness! You you can you can actually get hit by a little bit here. Oh boy. Okay. Wow. Oh my! Look at the little shadow. Oh, there's a there's a button on the wall. Oh boy. <laughs> Look at that little shadow I can stand within. That's not very much. Oh man. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I thought you could throw this up here and hit the Oh, you can. Okay, let me grab it and rot the door here. Holy moly, guys. So you can actually get hit by the light a little bit as the runaway kid. The music just changed. Oh, goodness gracious. I hear, like, whispering and stuff. Oh, these... What the heck is that? What is... Okay, I'm going to take this elevator down here. What is that little sound? It's like little whispers of like little kids running around. That's disturbing. Okay. Uh, creepy. Creepy. Um, run in here and find which pedestal this one goes on here. Oh, nice. Okay, we got one. Oh, goodness, what's that? The lights just flickered. Okay, we have one more statue to find somewhere in the house. Don't know where we gotta go here. What the heck is that? Everything went really dark, guys. 
there was something ran in front of me there. Like a little laughter of children. That was a little creepy. What is that? Little ch shadows of children running around there. That's just bizarre. Oh, we never did find the key. Um, guess we'll go upstairs and look for the key. That is just really creepy, guys. How can they make little children so creepy? All right. No children of the corner of this one. Children of the lady. Uh, okay, we got a key to find. Don't know where that is. What did we miss here? Oh, goodness gracious. Maybe it has to be something in this room we missed. Let's keep uh, running here. Is that... Okay, we got pictures here. Oh my goodness, do I still hear it going? Oh my gosh. Is there something in this room we have to get? Oh goodness gracious. Okay. Oh goodness gracious, there's a there's a shadow right here. There's a hole in the wall. Go through the hole. Oh my gosh, people. Uh a little red ball here. Oh, here's another flotsam, guys. Alright. Oh, how are we going to get out of this? I guess that's flotsam number two for us. I don't think we found any more. Um, goodness gracious. Goodness gracious, people. Oh, go, go, go. Oh, my gosh, people. Okay, there was nothing else in this room that I could see here. Oh, my goodness. Heart's still pounding on that one, guys. Okay. So we got two of the five flotsams. Didn't see any key. Um, got weird creaking sounds again. Okay, we have this. That opened up the door there to the right. Okay, we have that. No key still. Okay, let's go back downstairs. Where is the contraption here? Guess we gotta climb down the ladder. Hope we don't fall off. <laughs> okay, we're about half an hour in now. We only are allowed 60 minutes in the videos. Um, did I miss anything in this room here? We have a door here. Just can't get in. Okay. Um, what else was on this floor? Was that the... Goodness gracious, this thing is so hard to navigate in. Okay, still no um, idea what those shadows were. Okay, this is the book room.
we went in here and there was nothing here. Okay, we already got the statue from there. So, down, downstairs maybe, where the where the key is. Not sure. Okay, the area. Every time I go around this corner here, if you have to run away from the lady or something later, that corner is gonna kill me, guaranteed. Okay, we're back downstairs. We keep getting save indications. statue room didn't miss anything here okay oh my goodness guys I may have to edit that up me exploring trying to find out where this key is um, if we run out of time here I may have to cut some of that running out there okay guess we'll head this direction oh my gosh dolls okay she's not in this room anymore guys What is that? What is that? Oh my goodness, guys. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh! What the hell? Okay. Little demon spawn shadow children? I don't know what to call them. Um, that's what was running in front of me, and you cannot hold your flashlight, again, you cannot hold your flashlight steady. I mean, that's obviously designed so you die. Um, oh my goodness, guys, there's two of them. Oh, goodness gracious. Alright, we'll have plenty of times we die on this one, I'm pretty guaranteed. I cannot hold that flashlight still. Cannot do it. Um, there might be a different way, I just can't figure it out. Creeping maybe. Um, I guess I'll edit out the 100 deaths I'm going to have here, trying to figure out how to kill these things when you can't hold your flashlight still. And I'll get back with you when we have a success here on this, at least this portion of the room. Don't know why you can't, and then your flashlight just turns off. Like the, It works the whole time until you come against these things and then your flashlight turns off. Okay, you can destroy them by holding the light on them. Of course, you can't hold your light steady, and it turns off on you randomly. Alright. There's the key up on the um, cushion there. How do we get up there? What's in here? More creepy kids. Uh, back into the main. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab that key while we're here alive. <laughs> Can I jump up here? I don't know why you can't jump up there consistently. Okay, there we go, guys. I'll edit out the hundred jumpings there, trying to figure out how to get up on top of this thing here. Okay, let's take this back upstairs. Hopefully there won't be any more of those little demon spawn children in this room here. Oh my goodness, I just saw some more shadows of them. 
Oh my goodness. Look at them running across, guys. Oh my gosh. I guess we have to take the elevator up, which is why they have it, I guess. Okay. Man, these shadow children are just... They are so hard. I mean... Let's at least open this up here. That's going to do it for today's episode, guys. We're going to stop here at the door, um, open it up, and then we'll do the next part um, in a future episode. So... We just ran a little bit out of time here, guys. Uh, we're we're going to definitely go over 60 minutes if we continue on. So what I'm going to do is break this up into two separate parts. So check your notification bell there and make sure that you look for Future Little Nightmares DLC, The Residence Part 2, um, which I should load up both parts today, I hope. And hope you enjoyed it. Hit that like button. Hit subscribe if you haven't done so already. And we will see you on the next Dark Comet Adventures, guys. Take care.